essence can be found wherever dreams take root. Have you seen them? Those whispering plants that grow all over this old kingdom? I believe there is one just outside. Why not strike it with your dream nail and see what happens? Where are we? Resting grounds. Oh, the tree! The tree! Oh, it's the same circles that we saw. Wait, what? This is it? Oh! We want to collect a hundred of these. So every time we run into a tree, we just start collecting. Circles means dream. This might have to do with the overall mechanic of how when we die, our shade gets left behind in the spot. When we die, do we dream? I don't know. Weirdly enough, when you're in a dream, we're in a dream right now, but the, the location is the exact same. We didn't really get transported anywhere. Yeah, there's a lot of ghosts in the background. Oh. Are we out of the dream? Oh no, the ghosts are from this place. Oh my god, I'm so scared. What? Oh. Wait, 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 oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is a coffin, isn't it? Where, where are we? Oh! To protect the vessel. What is the vessel? See, they're talking about the place being eternal again. Under some definition, they still think that this is an awesome and beautiful place and... Yeah. The kingdom lasting eternal. Dreams are eternal. Are dreams eternal? Maybe they are. Maybe they aren't. Entombed husk, mummified remains, deformed and enraged by infection. It's a tomb here. Is the infection technically still happening right now? Why am I not getting infected? Like, what is the nature of this infection? Does it spread by air? If so, then why have I not been affected? Jeez. Oh, Certain creatures get affected. Maybe it has to do with the whole concept of higher beings and lesser beings. No, but Myla, Myla the Miner, she was definitely getting more infected. I went back and checked. Initially, she didn't have orange eyes. So that's very worrying then. Okay, these tombs, everything is a hidden pathway because it's just kind of... Um, oh. What the heck? It's a tomb. Whoa. Uh, let's look around a little bit more. Resting grounds. It's a cemetery here. Ah! Oh my god. Okay, the whole thing's gonna break. Whoa, well, hold on.
And some of them don't break. What? Whoa, shoot. Ah! Ah! Oh! Where was the last bench I sat on? At King Station. But maybe it'll put me back at the Seer. A mummified wanderer. I think we're in too dangerous of a spot to be... Oh my god, there's spikes back there. Even going back is a bit of a danger right now. I don't know what to do. What? Why can't I go up? Big mummy. Soul eater. Whenever we hear the ring, that's a good sign that something's nearby. Hey, I can probably go back and buy the notches now. One more charm notch? Should do that ASAP. Forgotten shaman artifact. Used to draw a soul from still living creatures. Greatly increases the amount of soul gained when striking an enemy with a nail. Hmm. Oh my god, four notches. Damn. It's nice if we have, like in the heat of battle, if we have soul, primarily we only can use it for attacking because healing just like standing around, it takes too damn long. But it'll be nice because Vengeful Spirit is very powerful. Okay. We might die here, man. I don't... Uh... We can go back out. Where was that one way? If we go out now, I'm hoping we'll find... Like, it's brighter outside, so we'll find some soul easily. Because the tombs are... They take a little bit of trial and error. Well, thank you. Oh. You know what? I think for now I'm gonna take away this fluke nest. Maybe having more hearts here would be good. <laughs> and then... Increases the power of spells. I want to try these ones too. Oh, there's so many I want. I know I want to try the long nail plus the mark of pride. That'd be insane. Steady body. Okay, I will try steady body for now. Keeps the bearer from recoiling backwards. Allows one to stay steady and keep attacking. This world, this cruel, sinful world. Why does she wake? Why does she persist? Ah, Limer, you could not know of tragedy as complete as Chase. True lovers stripped apart, two worlds that could not meet. And now, meddled lover, dead so long in time, dead so far away. Buried, Moina? Aye. Amongst its hateful kin that did deny our union, that did reject Chi's... outsideness. Am I in a church right now? Is this a bride? Grey Mourner. She doesn't suppose? Nalo, Nalo. Could she ask? Could she burden? Limmer, what's you? Could you deliver gift to her grave? Limmer is me? The gift is maybe small, but the trek is long. She rests among her kind near our queen's lush refuge. Would such a thing be done? She asks perhaps impossible things? Mad things? For Limmer to take up such quests 
would be a kindness she has nearly forgotten. Uh, she is, is this thing, the, the Grey Mourner? Delicate flower. Rare boon you grant, Limmer. It will be Chi's last request. After this, never shall Chi lay burden on another. A sacred flower is the offering. It is a rare, delicate object. One of a kind. You must cherish it. Must act as though it were your own heart. If you were to get hurt whilst carrying it, or did to attempt ride those jolting transit beasts, it would forever be destroyed. Her grave lies in the middle of the queen's overgrown estate. It is surrounded by her kind, who will not look kindly on your trespass. Take care, Lemire. My hopes I place upon you, and my fervent wish that the small solace may come to pass. Oh no, I feel like we shouldn't have accepted it without knowing what it is. Because what it's saying is that if I get hit, if I take a train, it'll immediately be destroyed. I can't ride the stagways. Ah, the stagways. Or take damage. Oh my god. Given to you by the Grey Mourner in the resting grounds, she has asked you to place it at the grave of her mantis lover in the Queen's Gardens. I don't even know where that is! Oh no, what have I done? Oh no, I shouldn't have accepted. Can you have it back for now? Her grave lies in the middle of the Queen's old retreat, a far journey from here, and the roads between are fraught with beasts. You don't even give me a direction, man. Save tiding on your journey. My heart does flutter to feel such kindness from so tiny a creature. What have I done? What have I done? Oh no. Her lover died. The Grey Mourner? She speaks a little bit differently. I wonder if that's because... Mm, maybe it's a dialect around here, or maybe she's from elsewhere, or maybe she lived a long time ago. But yeah, she wants me to put a flower at her mantis lover's grave. I don't even know where we- oh my god. I am so scared. I am so scared. We only have one of this. <sighs> Is it? Where we saw the alien wear stuff. I don't know how we're gonna do this at all. She already mentioned that it was um a treacherous way, a hard trek to go there, but if I don't even know where it is to begin with. Ugh. I'm treasuring it like it's my own life, but oh god. <sighs> One of these days. Oh, I don't imagine the Queen's gardens would be inside the tomb, so at least we gotta get out of here. At the very least. Where are we? Are we back to the beginning? Oh god, okay. Um... I'm really, really worried about the flower we're holding right now, but I don't think there's anything I can do about it. So I'll continue to play normally, but you know, trying really hard to not get hit, but that's, that's not possible. Not getting hit at all. But I'll try my best to avoid it, wherever we can. <laughs> Queen's Gardens? Oh yeah, we went up last time. We didn't go down. Oh. Well, I mean, now that we have the dream nail, I guess we should be going back to the tree places, right? Some of which I've marked on my map, some of which I haven't. Oh, 
that's right. Before we enter the dream, they, they mark the dreamer locations on my map. Not at the Black Egg Temple, surprisingly, but there is... Where's the third one? Uh, somewhere out of bounds. Well, it makes sense because we haven't come across it at all yet. I don't even know where the third one is, but, um, okay. Something to ignore for the time being, then? King's Pass. Could the Queen's Gardens be around Queen Station? It could be, but, I mean, the King's Pass is over here, and then... I don't think we would know where it is. No. Okay, uh, King Station. Kingdom's Edge. Whatever, we'll, we'll just keep going. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's in Deep Nest. At the very end of Deep Nest. Hmm. Huh. Can, can I touch that? And I can't use the stag stations. What? What was that thumping? Maybe it's above us, but I can't see it right now. There's some platforms. Oh! Hey! Saranagano. Gah, what a calm place. It's action I want. Vicious and deadly battle. This serenity is a bore. I thought you were gonna meet me at the arena! Whoa, Sana. So peaceful. So dull. Whoa, <laughs> I guess he's Sana. having trouble finding it too, and he, we're just kind of hanging out around here. Okay. Yeah, uh, did we even finish looking at... I mean, I guess I'll go back to the Seer when we get 100 Essence, but other than that... Uh... Nope. Yeah, there's some platforms up there that we couldn't get to, and this is just passageway, I guess. A little beach area. Oh! Salute! So what? This is perfect! This is perfect! Salubra! So what? But I can't get back up again, though. I... I don't see how I can get back up. No. But we know how to get there anyway, so it's not a big deal. Hi! I... Yes, please give me another notch. Thank you. Yeah, that's great, that's great. I need six more charms for the last notch. I can go back to the leg eater guy and buy the crap that I... Yeah, buy the stuff that breaks. But if I do that, I'm not gonna have enough to buy this notch anyway, so I'll hold off on it. But, um, I'll keep track. I'll keep track. Hmm. Okay, well, we're back here. With one extra notch. Good. I can have the compass. Is it necessary? Gathering swarm? More money? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man, because this one... This one is for when I get attacked, but right now with a flower, I don't even know. Oh, God. Anything... Is anything one? Or, you know what we could do? Mm, we could try taking off the Mark of Pride and using the Long Nail. But it doesn't give me any numbers, so I don't know which one's better. Are they the same? I imagine not, because this one has... This one costs three notches, but the other one two. But I could try it. I could try it. And then I'll have two notches. Free. For... what? Soul Catcher is nice. It's nice. I liked it when we had it. Dash Master. This one, I don't know when we would ever dash down. That's what I'm not sure about. Especially now that we have the Desolate Dive. Which I've basically never used in battle because it hardly ever comes up. <laughs> Quick Focus. This would be good too. Yeah, okay, let's let's try let's try like this. Yeah, I still feel like this is not that great, but I mean, you know, trying it. Let's try things out. 
I can't tell what my range is without trying it out on a monster. I'm pretty sure there was a guy here, right? So we could try... Yeah. Oh, perfect. Which one did I just get? These bugs have an arrogant air about them, even after dying. Overly proud of their long horns, I enjoy snapping them off. Oh god! <laughs> Damn. Yes. Is it because the horn kind of looks like a haircut? It looks like an Elvis haircut. Maybe that's why. Well, we're back in the Forgotten Crossroads again, which I think for now we have explored. So this dreamer is in between the fungal wastes and green path. And can we go down via um, that little section there then? Because we haven't gone back to green path for the purposes of clearing things out, especially the stone sanctuary. But I can't use the stag station. I can't use the stag station. Um, let's try to go back. Okay, from here. Let's... I have a rough idea of where we are. I don't know Forgotten Crossroads that well, but, um... Oh, Jesus. Ah! Okay. If we go back to the Grandpa Worm... I mean, it's along the way, so we sh probably should do that. It's just that I can't... <laughs> I don't even know where the Queen's Gardens are! This isn't gonna help. Oh my god! Don't hurt me, don't hurt me! Oh no, 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 this is the singular map that, um... There's nothing here, I don't think. This is not the right way. Hold on, I gotta try to remember. I have a vague idea of where we are, yeah? No? Maybe I should be using the one notch for the compass, huh? <laughs> but it's... Uh, I would favor having actual abilities. Oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, so so far the long nail seems okay. I'm not noticing like a super big difference between having it equipped or the Mark of Pride. Uh, no, we're not going to the stag station. No, no, no. I'm like, ridiculously careful right now. What? Oh, regular creatures give dreams too? Well, I didn't... What the heck? Oh god, wrong way, wrong- <gasps> No! It has been destroyed and is now worthless as an object of sentiment. Oh my god. Well, okay, honestly, it was gonna happen sooner or later. Um... Does that mean that I can't do this ever? Cause she says she only had one! Oh no! Well, uh, maybe I'll go back to her later on and see what she says. Light. Danger. Wait, what? So earlier I got one essence for killing the guy randomly and then... Pain. Is it like this guy's... This guy's inner thoughts or something? What? Yeah, I mean, it was- it was gonna happen sooner or later. I can't get this one. Come closer! So when I use a dream nail, I can't jump. I don't think I can get this guy. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well... It is what it is, I guess. <gasps> wait, 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 I want to try more... Kill... Hurt... 
the dream nail's purpose is to cut through the veil between dreams and the waken and reveal hidden dreams or open gateways. Uh, okay, you know what? Since we're here anyway, maybe I'll explore the Crystal Peaks now. <laughs> I change my mind every three seconds just based on where, where it's convenient. Yeah, okay, okay, sure. Since the flower is broken now, I can I can explore this area until we find a stag station or a map or something, but um safe dark. Oh why? Why can we do this? We're cutting through Okay, we haven't been here before. We're cutting through the veil between the dream and the waking, and that for some reason means that we can somehow read the thoughts of the people around here. Yeah, this is where we came down from, and I believe last time we couldn't reach the um, rancid eggs on the side. Okay. There's some heavy construction work going on. Oh! Oh, I can't hit it from the back! Damn. What? What the? There's an assembly line here. Active? Because the kingdom isn't really active anymore, so who's, who's mining? Who's making a profit here? That guy? Myla. Myla struck me as a freelancer, though. Not, like, working for anybody. <laughs> um... People- just people coming here for riches. Whoa! Mind bright must find more light. <gasps> Husk miner. Remains of a bug drawn to the crystal peak for its precious crystal. Its claw pick now doubles as a fierce weapon. It's infected. You can tell because when they speak, there's dot dot dot. <laughs> so, do we have a map of the resting grounds? I don't think so, actually. Yeah, that's a... Um, hmm... Because I wanted to mark where the Grey Mourner was as a reminder to remember to talk to her again, but she's not even here. That's okay. I'll just put a random marker here anyway. I'll know what it means. I'll know. I'll put a silver one here, because it's close to the color of the Grey Mourner. But for now, we forget about it. Oh no. Oh, there's a bench. This guy can throw the pick, we gotta be careful. No map updates? There might have been... Based off memory, I don't think there was more that we could have seen immediately. Oh my god. I mean, at the uh, resting grounds, but maybe I left a little bit too early because I was trying to, you know, desperately figure out where the Mantis Lover's grave was. I'm sure we'll be back. No worries. So we have some strange contraptions here now. One use only. Rancid eggs. Okay, they flip back after some time. Definitely haven't explored the whole of this map yet. Ooh. Yeah, that guy's hard to get because I... Oh! Oh, just standing in the spikes hurts me! So I can't let it make too many spikes then. Crystal Hunter. Fires shards of fast-growing crystal at intruders. Hmm. I think I hear a worm? Oh god. Where are you? 
Oh, oh, oh god, oh, <gasps> this is dangerous. Here you are. You are trapped, and I can probably get to you from above. Don't worry, I'll, I'll be back, I'll be back. Good enough. Don't touch the crystals. Big deal. I can kind of touch the crystals by pogoing. Just not normally, right? But this whole place is so noisy, and it's like, it's like a factory. Can I climb on that? Oh. <gasps> There's another one! Wait, hold on, I'll go this way, maybe. Oh, what? What? Who is keeping caterpillars trapped inside jars? Who is doing this? This is awful. Multiple of them, too. And not just behind the jar, but also behind the contraption and all that. I'll get you, don't worry. Oh, this one's faster. Got you! Meow, meow, meow. I got you, and I'm gonna get your friend, too. Woo! Whoa, 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 dude! Eat when <gasps> wait, it's impervious. I can't even attack it. Okay, I can, but only like that, really? Crystal crawler. This charges searing beams of light from the crystals on its back as it crawls around, seemingly unaware. Hmm. Wait, is there a way for me to attack it besides ooh, besides using Vengeful Spirit? Yeah, this creates some obnoxious situations here. You know what? No. If we're gonna go past here, I definitely want to get more soul so we can use Vengeful Spirit to kill it. I don't want to do a whole puzzle solving thing where we try to like avoid the beams. That's just not realistic. So let's get some soul back here. Without killing myself, hopefully. Oh, shoot. Well, there's little crystals flaking off when I hit the guy's back. If I keep hitting it, will I eventually be able to um, kill it or hurt it? Needs more testing. See, the blue heart, the lifeblood thing, it's not useful if we're not near a bench. Because right now, it's just taking up notches, but it's not doing too much. I feel like we can go with a long nail, though. It's not... It's not too big of a difference. I feel like it's okay. Might have to adjust my timings a little bit. Okay, we're back down here. Did I even finish looking down here? Oh man, dude. Where was the bench? It's right here. So we can get two hearts, or should I try something else? We have the long nail and quick focus. Oh, I didn't really- I wasn't paying attention to whether the healing was faster. Would anything else here be good? Defender's Crest. Soul Eater. More soul, more healing. Four! Freaking four notches. Greatly increases amount of soul gained when striking an enemy with a nail. I can take this one away, but four? Four is a lot. Spore mushroom. When focusing soul, emit a spore cloud that slowly damages enemies. Okay, we have so much right now. Hey, this one plus the, the defender crest. <laughs> We'd have so much odors around us. Oh my god, let's do it. <laughs> Just do it. Why not? Hey, maybe that's a synergy, you know? You never know. So this one's gonna make it so that if I try healing, I'll damage people around me. But I don't usually do that. It's It would be dumb to try to heal when people are still around. But we can. Now we can. 
And this one means I'm... I'm dirty. <laughs> yeah, the dirtiness apparently does damage people slowly. Apparently. Guess we'll try it. Ah! I can hit the minor axe too. The pickaxe. I didn't finish looking at this map yet, did I? I don't think so. It's okay, I'll... <laughs> I'll try to go like this for a while. See, it's flicking off, but uh, I don't think it's actually doing anything. It's just a visual effect. Oh! Did you see? It was getting hit by the odor. Alright, good, good. I have a full thing. Oh, this guy can dash around too. Oh, I can't go up like that. I gotta go this way. Oh, it's hurting him! It's hurting him! At what rate? I, uh... <laughs> it only hurt people close to me. Only the people I love and care about. <laughs> Okay, now we can try this. Because what I'm thinking is, we can... We can kill them if we just don't like them. We don't have to do any of this, like... Okay, or I could just go up like that, too. <laughs> I did all of that, but I didn't end up using it anyway. Cornifer! Well, it's so loud here, I can't even hear you humming. Whoa, shh! Damn you. Oh, 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 look at the odors! Oh my god. So I should try healing to kill people then. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cornifer. Come to scale the mountain? I've heard tale of a summit way up there. Too far for me, though. And I'm not really one for heights. Thank you. Okay, I, are we at the jagged place right now? The jagged place jutting out to the left? I jabbed myself on one of those crystals back there. Awful sharp they are, and all over the place. You'd best watch yourself if you're heading up. Can I... To chart the world, what joy! If only a Zelda could share the thrill. Oh, this is giving us additional insights into the people some, for some reason. But it only gives us dialogue, we can't get essence from that. Which is still fine, and I... I can't go up there. Hmm, okay, so maybe this is a place I should mark then. To remind myself that there's something here I can't get. I think it's like right here, right? Uh, not a. I mean, it's a lack of access, but whatever. Just put a marker there. I'll figure it out. Can I pogo off of that? Oh, it's all the way at the bottom. It's not at the peak of the crystals. Okay. There's a- there's a broken train a minecart track? Maybe I should just forget about this for now. Pogoing will be harder without the Mark of Pride, I think. But I have the long nail still. I- Whoa! Shard might! feeds on crystal dust and uses crystallized spines to protect itself from danger. <laughs> He's looking at the... Oh, there's another bench. Don't mind if I do. Uh, I think the bench is in use right now. Ah! Oh god. Oh god.
Oh my god, I was totally- He's not dead. He just left. I was totally caught off guard, cause you know, a bench usually means safe place, right? Holy god. I think the- the healing- the healing- <laughs> wait, 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 I gotta try this individually because I can't tell if that's that big because... Oh, but I'm not hurt right now. Hold on. Yeah, if I just do it individually, is the spore cloud that big? Yeah, okay, that's definitely some kind of an interaction then, right? Because that's the normal animation for it. And then because I added it to the... The dung thing, now it's making a dung cloud. Oh yeah! And then, the spore is something that normally has... Yeah, it attacks enemies. And then, I guess this one also attacks enemies. So it's like double attacking the enemy. Okay, cool, we found an interaction, I think. Sweet. Yeah, yeah, I know where we are. It's cool, it's cool. A little bit concerned about that guy... Still being alive. But at least he's not crystallized anymore. Okay, I need some way to be able to get up higher. In here, we, we're starting to come across places where this ability is an issue. And we just haven't come across it yet, so maybe it'll be more appropriate for me to come back once I've found that. <laughs>